Welcome to Fantastic Vision. Please subscribe us before you watch today's video. The US chip industry is very powerful and has a huge knowledge patent system. It is very difficult for other countries to catch up and surpass, and it may even infringe on intellectual property patents. However, Chinese scientists changed their minds and broke the ice in the field of optical computing chips. The Chinese Academy of Sciences developed an ultra-highly integrated optical convolution processor, which made the Chinese chip overtake in a corner. Some foreign media said, breaking the American myth. What kind of technological breakthrough is this? What is the practical significance? The development of industries such as artificial intelligence, big data, and cloud computing has prompted people to put forward higher requirements for chip computing power. Among them, artificial intelligence requires a large amount of computing resources to process complex data and algorithms. The development of chips enables artificial intelligence algorithms to run more efficiently and achieve a better balance between real-time and energy consumption. Big data analysis requires powerful computing power to process massive amounts of data. The performance improvement of chips and the development of cache technology have improved the data processing capability and accelerated the speed and efficiency of big data analysis. Cloud computing requires powerful computing power and storage capacity to support large-scale data processing and storage requirements. Most of the technology industry is inseparable from the support of chips, which provide the necessary computing and storage capabilities and promote innovation in technology and applications. However, how to obtain strong chip computing power has become a difficult problem. Most of the chip sources in the industry are provided by American companies. NVIDIA's GPU, Intel's CPU, and Qualcomm's mobile terminal SOC, etc., all dominate the market. It is not easy to break the monopoly of US companies. It is indeed not easy to start from the traditional chip development path, but if we explore from the field of optical computing, the result will be different. Optical computing is a technology that uses optical signals for information processing and computing. It combines optical devices and optical signal transmission and utilizes the high-speed transmission and parallel processing capabilities of light to achieve efficient computing and data processing. The Chinese Academy of Sciences has made great achievements in this field. According to the news published on the official website of the Chinese Academy of Sciences, its Semiconductor Research Institute, has developed an ultra-highly integrated optical convolution processor, which marks a major breakthrough in the field of optical computing in China. Nowadays, industries such as artificial intelligence are pursuing the ultimate chip computing power, and the transmission speed of optical computing chips is faster than traditional silicon-based chips. At present, the transmission speed of optical computing chips can reach tens of billions of operations per second. Compared with NVIDIA's top A100 GPU chip, the transmission speed of the optical computing chip is 1.5 to 10 times faster. Some foreign media said, breaking the American myth, the ultra-highly integrated optical convolution processor developed by the Chinese Academy of Sciences will change the status quo of Chinese chips, and its practical significance cannot be underestimated. First, 
The ultra-high integration of the optical convolution processor means that it can integrate more functions and performance on one chip, thus achieving more efficient optical signal processing. Such technological breakthroughs help to increase the speed and efficiency of information processing. Secondly, the development of optical convolution processors plays an important role in the fields of optical communication and optical computing. Optical communication is a high-speed, high-capacity communication method, while optical computing can provide faster calculation speed when processing large-scale data. Ultra-highly integrated optical convolution processors can bring better performance and broader application prospects to these fields. Moreover, this research breaks through the technical difficulties of optical device manufacturing and integration and provides new ideas and directions for the development of optical devices. This has a positive role in promoting the development and innovation of the optical device industry. With these practical effects, it is possible for China to realize the corner overtaking of optical computing chips. Although silicon-based chips have been widely used in computers and electronic equipment, with mature manufacturing processes and a rich industrial chain, Moore's law has already faced its limit. If it is impossible to further break through the boundaries of physical rules, there will be more and more optical computing is one of the innovative technology explorations. Once it becomes a trend in the future, related industries will continue to expand, providing a foundation for the achievements of the Chinese Academy of Sciences to be implemented. Although the optical computing chip is still in the research and development and experimental stage, Facing many technical challenges and commercialization problems, its potential cannot be underestimated. The invention of any kind of chip technology takes time to settle, just like when the United States invented the integrated circuit and created the first chip of mankind. No one would have thought that these inventions could change the world and it even established the influence of the United States as a chip power. In the future, with the further development of optical materials and optoelectronic device technology, optical computing chips are expected to surpass and subvert silicon-based chips. And all of this is brought about by the ultra-highly integrated optical convolution processor developed by the Chinese Academy of Sciences. It is hoped that one day it will be implemented as soon as possible to boost the development of Chinese chips. If you agree with the point of view of this video, please like it, welcome to forward, leave a message and share.